Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Persona 5 Royal. In the last episode, we finished up uh, Sai's Palace, and now all we have to do is send out the calling card. If you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button, smash that like button, and share the video. And let's get on into it, shall we? So, we are going to be watching the Home Shopping Channel. We're going to be purchasing the Sturdy Ointment set. fast forward to dialogue and next we're going to be playing at uh penguin sniper or oh, i'm not doing yeah we're doing good darts and billiards so we're going to be plays we're going to play some billiards welcome what do you play what do you play so max out our technical rank. Thank you. Thank you. So now, every time you get attack, it will guarantee you knock down. Basically, by the end of this. Okay, let's get this started. I hope I can do this. <laughs> this intensity right before the game starts. I love it. Sank. Sunk. The way the balls are positioned, I need to make a difficult shot to clear this. Huh? That pose, are you going for that shot? Nice. Now that's what I call a massive shot. Beautiful. What an entrancing sight. I knew you could do it. You actually pulled out that shot. That's why you're our leader. Looks like the challenge you brought everyone together and our technical rank will max out that was fun, huh? even if you don't win it's just fun to sink the balls into the pockets glad to see everyone had fun i gotta say though wow. thanks to pulling billiards i think you learned more about making bold decisions for when the time calls for it so what is that our guts yeah that was so much fun that was fun please invite me for the next time too Will do. Bye. And our day is basically like, like our this today is free too, basically. You'll see. You'll see. Yeah, we're gonna send the calling card right now. Jeez. Go to the hideout. Who's here? Oh, I'm so okay. Yeah, all we gotta do now is send the calling card. So, when do you want to send it? The earlier the better, right? No. In my opinion, we should wait until right before the time limit. May I ask your reasoning behind that idea? Sai-san is a realist, even if she believes the Phantom Thieves exist. Do you think she knows how they steal hearts? Furthermore, there is a chance she expects that she herself will be targeted. So because her heart is ready for any possibility, the calling card might not have enough effect? I only say that theoretically, but I believe so. Hence, it would be prudent for us to wait until we are driven into a corner to act. If we do so with no time to spare, I assume even Saison would have to be somewhat agitated. Hmm. Ensuring the treasure actually appears. That sounds quite logical. Impressive, Akachi-kun. So, it is a bit vexing that you know more about my sister than I do. <laughs> oh, that's only because of my work as a detective. Well then, if our time limit is November 20th, and we act the day after sending the calling card, shall we send it out on the 18th? We should prepare as much as we can before then. Well, I can't complain about having more time. Make sure you're ready, everyone. And yeah, we are not going to be sending the calling card. You'd like to wait on the call. Just Sorry. like we went through this dialogue, we will be yeah, uh, we will be waiting until um the 18th to send the calling card. 
our current objection is preparing for the 19th. And we literally have nothing to do today because I already maxed out um, Shinya's confidant. Because we were ahead on that. So, what to do today? I don't want to mess up that. Well, at least she has something. Um. Now, I guess we can go to the maid cafe. Works for me. I don't know if we've gone here yet. No, we haven't. Now with the menu. Oh my gosh, the atmosphere in here is kind of cute. And it's it's one of the side, a slowing way. Welcome home. Oh, Clara, you're clumsy made. Goodness. Is this your first time here? Embarrassingly so. That's how everyone feels their first time. This is your home, so please relax. Oopsies, I almost forgot to inform my first time visitor. How clumsy of me. We offer stamp cards here. If you collect 20 stamps, you'll get a special item. You get one stamp per 1,000 yen you spent. Spent. It would make me so happy if you collect a lot of them. So what would your order be? The most expensive thing on your menu. Absolutely. A sincere omelet, correct? As you wish, master. Hey. This is all pretty overwhelming. The pink hurts me. I, 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 I swear, that's what I said before. I don't know if I said it out loud, but like the pink is killing my eyes right now. Here I go. It's literally killing my eyes. Now I'll start drawing with sincerity on your omelet. Let's see. Uh, what should I write? Oh, oh no, I messed that. up. I'm sorry, Master. I was trying to write the impairments of all worldly matter. What did you say? Why did she pick that? Master, I try my best. Would you please forgive me? Go fix it. Yeah, I knew it very well, Master. That is some guts, man. Charmer guts, pick one. That was sure, that was unique. Either way, I think you learned how to get people to like you. Or both. Hey, I'll take both. Master, I'm sorry for messing up today. But your strictness allowed how showed me how reliable you really are. This is your first visit, I'll give you a stamp card. Let's see. Every Saturday is our maid day where you can get four additional stamps. I highly recommend you visit us then. Today you get five, leaving you with a total of five Take stamps. Care. Have an amazing rest of your day. I'll be waiting patiently for your next visit. Oh my god. We're never coming back, by the way. I'm not. You have to visit four times to get the achievement, basically. No, shut up. Screw, screw your dialogue. Now, you're back. Yo. another box came for you. Hey. There is a very, very specific reason. Oh. I'm just gonna know it's not the first, I guess. There's a very, very, very specific reason why I didn't get rid of any of my personas yet. Hey, we literally haven't done anything. some money. Hey, 5,000 yen. And two, we're going to be doing something. Basically. Oh, uh, I need a voice. Oh, that's hilarious. Wait. Do I have a justice? Hold up. I don't think I do. Um, we need the Empress. Priestless? Hold up. Who is the Priestless Arcana? Oh, Makoto. Yeah, we don't need that anymore. What is the, um, stats of it? Hold up, what? Yeah, we're keeping that. Um... Need a Hermit. We don't need Ose. Definitely not need Ose. I'm gonna need to get a Justice Persona. For one thing, I mean, I don't think you need it, but we're gonna get it.
Now, while we're getting this, I will say this. Once we're done with pancakes, which is going to be this rank, don't worry. Um, we're basically going to be screwing around like a lot now because we really have no other confidants to do at night. We kind of finished them off. These are the paths you have walked. And I don't think there is any more that come up for nighttime, that is. I could be wrong, but I don't know. What? No slacking off. Now, also, I guess I should just fairly warn you now. Um, hold up. Where is it? Oh my god, where are the confidants? There. There are three things that you need. You need to have Dr. Snacks at rank 9 before November 18th. You need uh, Sumi at max rank by November 18th. You need Pancakes at rank 8 before November 18th. This is all for something, but you need it. It's vital. You need it. You gotta get it done. You'll find out why when... You'll find out why sooner or later. Like, I'm not gonna spoil it for people, but like, you'll figure it out. But you need it. We're all prepared. All we need to do is wait for the proposed date. Huh, perhaps it's not quite appropriate, but I confess, I'm a little excited for this. Do you have some time? I, well, I want to talk to you about something. Hold, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm saving beforehand, because I'm doing this today. I gotta save. Hold up. I have to save. Because if I screw up, we gotta stay- we gotta reload it. There we go. Wait. Hold up. I understand. Are you ready to join me in Mementos? Yeah, I basically skipped over the text. Whatever. Um, I should just go back. Um, there we go. You have time. I want to talk to you about something. It'd be best if we went somewhere where there weren't any many people around. How about let's say Mementos? Nobody can get in our way there. Do you want us the two of you to go in Mementos alone? Well, you guys are strong enough that you should be fine. But be ready for anything, I guess. Thank you. Then not to the Shibuya. I catch you wanted to go with you, right? Then I'll just be waiting outside. Be careful. This place should do nicely. Fun fact, this is like one of the only confidants that has dialogue during their thing. Normally they only have one during 1 in 10. But there you go. Would you want to discuss... This. Uh-oh. Remember what I told you? If you ever won against me using my right hand, I'd take you on with everything I've got. Uh, okay. Uh, you wanna fight? Exactly. Your insights allowing you to determine my dominant hand, your quick wit, and most of all, how fast you've grown. You've exceeded my expectations in every way. Thus, I've built up this urge to duel you without holding anything back. All right, let's do this. Thank you for indulging my selfish request. Don't kill me. No need for pleasantries at this point, correct? So you can't get below like 20 HP, by the way. Let's go. Uh, you just gotta know a catchy. We're probably gonna lose. You won't be able to defeat me unless you actually fight with lethal intent. Now, show me your true skills. Yeah, we're probably gonna die. As you start, uh, make sure you have a. The thing is, Ranga is weak to bless. This is weak to curse. Null's bless, weak to curse. 
I didn't know this existed. Okay, well I guess we're switching over and then we're gonna start off by using guns. And we missed half of them. Um... Why are we missing? This is gonna be difficult. Um... What would Akachi be weak to? I don't know what Akachi would be weak to. I don't, what is the catchy weak to? Persona. I don't know. Go Robin Hood. That's disappointing. Please don't die. Okay. Persona. This is just gonna be like rinse and repeat, I guess. And we're dead. Well, we're gonna have to load the save file. Give me a sec. Okay, let's try this again. Let's go. So my plan this time is we're just gonna go all out. Right rider. We're gonna charge. Can you take this? I can. And then we're gonna run a triple down. Are you kidding me? What a joke. Nah, loser. Ha. Oh, I'm weak to this thing. Oh, I block it. Why didn't I know about this before? Well, there you go. Oh god, Megadolia is gonna kill me. Yep. It seems I've bested you. Well, we're trying this again, boys. If you were truly... I mean, I guess the thing is, though, like, he got, um... Thank you. My, um... My first triple down missed, so... I'm gonna kind of- I'm honestly gonna blame it on that. I guess... I could run a down shot, to be honest. I could try to run a down shot. And by downing him, I can get a chance to charge. That's kind of, just kind of like a waste, but who cares, really. I really should have gotten, um, block, uh, physical on, uh, Joker. I'm gonna have to run a, um, a common medic. Again. Nice. How fascinating. Persona. Very fascinating, eh? This is gonna deal about a hundred. Oh god, I did two forty-four. Jeez. Um. Pray and hope to God he doesn't kill. Okay. Hi. I want you to run a curse. This is stupid. Hate it. Okay. Let's try this again. This whole episode is just gonna be me trying to kill Akachi, apparently. Yes, we can run like the same strat as what we did last time. This isn't good. Donum let's run a uh, let's see here. Wrong thing. Run on a charge, I guess. Time for my comeback, so to speak. I'm about ready to just get what you skate like. Go down. Um. 
duplicate uh null is that's where I'm at. I get the way come on. Don't be that much. Okay. Persona! There. Persona! Oh god. Okay. We're gonna uh run a How to come a minute. Oh, uh, you just gonna kill himself right here? Ah, uh, that would have been funny. Wait, do we win? Hey! No wonder you're the leader of the Phantom Thieves. Well, I kind of wanted to kill you, but you know, I wanted to eat the pancakes. You've caught up to me on this front already, too. I know, right? Are you satisfied? Of course not. But if we went any further, we'd both go beyond the point of no return, wouldn't we? I mean, if you want to have some fun. In all honesty, I'd love to see just how far we can go. Oh yeah, man, me too. But we have an important mission coming up. Until that's finished, you're a vital ally to me. Okay, well, after that mission, can we can we kill each other? That'd be kind of cool. You're done here. Let's go. Okay. Once again, I've learned something new about you today. As allies fighting alongside one another, your strength is truly reassuring. In all honesty, it's to the point that I'd be relying on you in a pinch. I'd say the same for you. Is that so? Well, that would please me greatly. I'm sorry I asked you to indulge me, but I do feel a bit better now. Good. All right. By the way, about that duel. If we had fought to the end, do you see yourself winning? I definitely wouldn't lose. I had a feeling you'd say that. I'm going to be entirely honest with you. I hate you. Okay. Your deft handling of your unfortunate circumstances. Your uniqueness. Your ability to surpass me. All these irritate me. Someone jelly. You're the one person I refuse to lose to. Ah, uh, same here, man. You really are. No. I'll let you have this win today. But next time I will be victorious. Alright. Let this be my proof. It says one of the gloves the catcher usually wears. Is a tradition in the West to throw one's glove at their opponent when demanding a duel. That's the Southwest, and that's a tradition that was like you know a century ago, but should the opponent accept the glove? The duel is also accepted. I accept wink wink click this wink wink. You have to click this wink wink. Make certain that you never forget. I am the one who will defeat you. Alright. <sighs> Look at the time. Let's call it a day for now. Hello. No, I've already seen the dialogue. We're not training with you. <laughs> Jeez. Grab your nose. Ah, 
last time we were talking about court trials, where today we'll be learning about what well, you're asking if the Phantom Thieves would be given a trial if they get caught. Of course they would. All they would need to do is prove a link between the deaths and their activities. In short, they would be on you would they would be put on trial for murder. Nay, you loser, you the cat. Right? Tell me how old you have to be to listen in on a trial any age. This is it. That's right, no age restrictions for listening on a trial. You can get in whether you're 0 or 85. Youth crimes are an exception, but it's basically open to the public, meaning you can all go attend. Well, I imagine the visitor seats for the Phantom will be full if the Phantom Thieves are put on trial. Everyone is dying to know who exactly the culprits are and how they did it. Oh, I always got it right. Yeah, I know. Thank you. However, their method is how it connects to the murder and must be proven, or the sentence on the methods of the Phantom Thieves user far exceeded human knowledge. I'd imagine in order to prove it, they'd have to catch them in the act. Hmm. Good luck. Hey. So it's in the car on the 18th, which means there's only 10 days left. 10 days, man. 10 days. Imagine that. 10 days. Anyways, we're gonna go to Jimbocho here. Come on. There's literally no point to books anymore. We're just doing it for completion. Uh, knowing the heart. Thank you. It expands technical conditions, by the way. You should definitely read that. We're going to be... I don't know why we went there first, so we're going to go back to the library. We're going to be returning uh, Illusory Popus, and we're going to be reading The Cry of Luthu. And next, we're going to be uh, finally finishing Makoto's Antidote. Honestly, can I just, like, text her? Ah, come on! All right, let's see here. Or is she still in the council room? Yeah, right, literally right here. Okay, have fun. So, I finally made up with Aiko. I think she knew it deep within her heart. And seeing him like that finally helped her realize. You're still not gonna let me forget that, hmm? Well, I'm glad she didn't get into any danger. Oh, and she told me she quit her job. Right now, she doesn't know what she wants to do, but she's going to go to college and figure things out. So in the end, Aiko's going to start seriously focusing on her studies again. I plan on doing the same as well. No, that's not it. This time, I'm not seeking anyone's praise. And I'm not trying to show off my intelligence. I simply want to fulfill my own personal goals and dreams. Before now, I didn't have a clear vision of what that meant. I was lost in life. But thanks to you, I finally come to realize it. My dream is to become a police commissioner. That is why I need to study. Because it's the head of police operations. I'll need an extensive academic background, though. There are too many incidents in this country that are never brought to light. That host was one. Villains who prey on the hearts of the weak with cowardly, legally questionable methods. My father risked his life trying to catch a group of those people. I will never forgive them. But I won't be able to eradicate them all on my own. Instead, I want to head an organization that will destroy the lawless and help rescue victims. I hope so. That is 
the justice I aim for. I also believe it will be a continuation of my father's legacy. Honestly, it's a little strange that I found the true meaning of my studies outside of my studies. I think now I'll be able to see the world even more differently. Thank you for all your help. Must have been difficult babysitting the uptight Miss President, right? Even so, I'm glad I asked you. I am thou, thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened the ultimate secret of the priestess, granting thee infinite power. By the way, you can rely on me when you need it. I won't go easy on you if you hold back. Now then, in order to fulfill my dream, I'll need to be accepted into my first choice college. <laughs> what a funny thought. Studying to become a head of police while working as a thief. I will. The objective is the same after all. Exposing the evil lurking in the dark shadows. Oh, that's right. And thanks for helping me. I'll gladly assist you with your studies as well. <laughs> you had best be ready. Let's go home. Alright, back to the maid cafe. Actually something I was supposed to do, believe it or not. Same thing. Literally just fast forward. Nobody cares. Go fix it. Hmm. Lower house disbanded. It was an internal split. Messiah Shishido, he's the only one. He's the only one that can stand up for what's right, the only one who can make good on this word. That's the kind of person we need leading this nation, especially in times like these. Shido leads the United Future Movement, right? He was right, we'd be, if we'd taken them the, the Phantom Thieves seriously from the start, they'd be behind bars now. What took them first, do you think? Regiment change or the apprehension of the Phantom Thieves? Mona's just like, hey, shut up. Alright. 
Next up is a text message. Including the day we gotta carry out the plan, there's only 11 days left. Time is really slipping away. What if will happen to us if we fail? We won't fail. Kinda of tough to say that for sure though. Well, our lives will be over if we fail. Maybe, but we can't lose heart before we've even done anything. If we do that, we'll just mess everything up, even the parts we can definitely succeed in. Hmm, you actually said something wise for once. You wanna fight? You two get along so well. Uh, how so? This is an outrageous claim. That's what I should be saying. Come on, stop it. Let's try to keep tensions low. We're all feeling anxious. Even you, Makoto? Yes, it can't really be helped this time. That's not how I raised you. Get a hold of yourself, Ryuji. Are you singling me out? Uh, this is why we shouldn't leave, says at home. Pure example. Nine days left. Stop reminding me. I'm well aware of how much time is left. Yo. The next promise on the list is go to school, right? Pretty hard stuff for the second boss. It's gonna be even harder knowing there are people there too. Well, but ain't no time at the present. Come on, let's go. Uh -huh. You're going to school? Oh, uh, never mind. Just go have some fun. Good lord. Here we are. School. I think my heart's gonna pop out of my chest. Oh, God. Well, what are you doing here? Um, well... A promise list like you used to make with your mother. Well, do you want to come in? Um... Can I use a go home instead? I like that reference. Uh, let's do this together. I was hoping you'd say that. I'm sure you'll be fine. Most of the students have left already and all the teachers are in a meeting. Oh, and I'll join you. I can use my position as student council president to avoid any problems that may arise. Really? You're incredible. If I've got you two with me, this place is going to be as easy to fight as fighting a trash mob. I'm not sure I understand. That's a good thing, right? Anyway, come on. I'll show you around the school. Um... This is the cafeteria where some students choose to eat lunch. Lunch. That reminds me of this one time I was the only kid who didn't get a pudding with my meal. On this other time, I ate a strawberry with ketchup on it. I didn't notice because they're both red. It was really gross. Um, anyway, the cafeteria is pretty boring, huh? Let's move on. Um... This is a school library. We have all the regular academic fair here. Textbooks, encyclopedias, study guides. We also have a few manga and light novels at the request of some especially uh, vocal students. So many books. Do you like to read, Futama? Mm-hmm. Back in elementary school, I memorized the titles and all the books on a shelf in just one glance. The other kids thought I was making it up when I told them now. But then when I recited all the titles to prove it, they just laughed and called me a freak. Am I weird? No, you're talented. I don't want to be talented if it's going to creep people out. And the school's the worst. Why are we here? Well, should we move along? Only the classrooms remain, though on second thought, maybe we should pass on those today. Hmm. Shall we head back to the entrance? I'm sorry, Futaba. No. Don't be, it's my fault. I remembered all this sad stuff on my own. I guess dwelling on the past is just a bad habit of mine, huh? This is the right answer. Huh? What kind of weird fetish stuff are you into? What? Honestly, Futaba, it's clear how much you've improved recently. You would never have gotten so worried about this before. Huh? What I mean is, worrying about something is the first step toward changing it. Coming to school like this is a huge breakthrough, Futaba. You're doing great. Right, Ren? Ooh, Nods. Wait, so you're happy with me even though I got totally depressed? Hmm, is this like that saying about when life gives you lemons? Maybe I can make lemonade for the phantom thieves, or figuratively speaking. You're right. That would be wonderful. Why do I keep <laughs> clicking my... Oh my god, why do I keep doing that? It's weird. 
should probably stop playing video games for today after I'm done recording this. Oh yeah. I really should though for today. It's a position hack. Chance to instantly hold up enemies in starting a battle. Alright. I'm sure you would make a lot of friends if you decided to come to school now, Kutaba. Friends. Kutaba? Oh, I'm nothing. Alright, I went back to school, so that means promise number two is all done. Okay. Anyways, Hello. let's retreat for now. Uh, what are you feeling for dinner? How about curry? That's always curry, okay. so what's a surprise? Time to make like a rabbit and hop on out of here. I would think we would have walked LeBlanc together, but you know. Boy, thanks a bunch for showing me around the school today. Feeling crazy uh, fulfilled, but feeling crazy fulfilled, but also super tired to TBH. You don't say that out loud, but all right. I can't believe everyone runs on such a high level dungeon every single day. You guys are really OP. I get the sense a lot of luck faster if I stay close to you, but I still think I'd run out of MP way too fast. The real world is a scary place. Uh, I'll help you anytime. Really? But I still gotta work on it, huh? So much for taking it easy on me. Yeah. But I do feel like I'm making a lot of progress thanks to you, Ren. I'm gonna keep going at my own pace for the, my next goal too. Gotta focus on healing when you need to, right? And I can't just keep getting carried through all of this. I gotta learn how to fend for myself. Okay, later. Ah, you're back. All right, and even though it might be a short one, that's gonna do it for today's episode of Persona 5 Pro because I need some rest. In the next episode, we have 11 days until the investigation, so 9 days until the 19th. Got some time to do some confidant stuff and start some new things, so yeah. If you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button, smash that like button, and share the video, and we will catch you all in the next episode of Persona 5 Royal. Peace.